There's two common failures on this one. So you're going to see common failure number one, and, and next we'll talk about number two. So most common failure is really low or no fuel pressure. And of course, the symptom of that is going to be poor run quality. It's going to run lean because the engine's going to be running out of fuel. Now, that's usually an intermittent fault. It could take several hours of uh, mowing or continued operation before it occurs, so it can be difficult to catch. It doesn't always work that way. Sometimes they just fail and the engine won't start. And we can test it with fuel pressure and doing electrical tests. As far as fault codes, again, usually none. If it happens long enough, it may set a 0, 0174 or maybe even a max adaption code, a 171, if the fault is prolonged. Like many of these failures, usually it's been running so poorly at that point that the operator is no longer willing to keep limping it along. So likelihood of setting fault codes is low. Best way to test for it is hopefully catch it in the act with the fuel pressure gauge on it. You're going to see that fuel pressure drop off to next to nothing. And then if we can catch it in the act, it's a good idea to gravity feed test that fuel pump module to make sure we don't have a fuel delivery issue. A pickup line problem in the tank, a lift pump issue, a hose that when it gets hot all of a sudden gets kinked, a plugged or restricted fuel filter, any of those things can cause low fuel pressure. This pump has no suction capabilities. It has to have fuel provided to it. The next most common failure, fuel is exiting the vent fitting. So that's the fitting on top of the fuel pump module. You can't really see it too great in this picture here. I'll try and highlight that. The symptom is gonna be poor run quality. Now it's gonna run excessively rich. That vent fitting is connected to a hose. That hose goes directly to the throttle body. So if we're pushing fuel out of that vent fitting, it's getting pumped right into the throttle body and making the engine extremely rich. So rich that at high speed, you maybe won't notice much. It might smell, it might burn your eyes a little bit. You might see black exhaust. But if you drop the engine down to the low speed setting, it may actually stall. Related fault codes may set a 0, 0172, that's a max adaption code, if the fault happens long enough. Best way to test it, I like to take that hose off of the fuel pump module, put a test hose on it, put that test hose in a suitable container that can handle gasoline, and start and run the engine. And if uh, fuel comes out of that fitting and starts going into your container, we know we have a faulty fuel pump module. If that does occur, definitely make sure to look at the fuel quality and the fuel filter because if the wrong size fuel filter has been installed, meaning it's not a 10 micron filter, you're gonna allow larger debris in there than what it can handle, um, and that can cause this problem.